can Elaine Thompson era reclaimed her dominance in world sprinting? It's a question. After all, she at one point held the record for the fastest woman in both the 100 and the 200 meter sprints, only surpassed by Sharika Jackson recently in the 200 meters. Thompson had a bad 2022 season, a season in which she lost the 200 meter title and came third in the 100 meters world championship final in the United States. 2023 track season will be very important to Elaine Thompson because she has to make the ascension back to the top and she has a 2023 season to do so. Thompson, however, have started the 2023 season on a positive note by running 7.15 in Kingston at the recently concluded Queen Grace Jackson meet and a few days later ran a 7.30 in Norway. Though these may not be impressive times by any stretch of the imagination, they can act as a moral booster and therefore sharpener for the outdoor season. My dear beloved track fans, let's not forget that Elaine Thompson is still the fastest woman in the world with a time of 10.54 seconds, making her the fastest alive. The summary of my argument is this, if Elaine Thompson can string together a few 60 meter victories and maintain her fitness level, she will be dangerous this outdoor season. It's also noted that she was working out in the gym and therefore she should be stronger and well conditioned to go fast. The 100 and 200 meters for women this season will be hotly contested because Abby Steiner is in fantastic shape. Alia Abs is super out the blocks. Kelly and Fraser is ever dominant and Sherika Jackson is looking to overtake them all. My analysis is this. If any super athlete who have the better part of the early season will be very hard to beat when the outdoor season begins. Elaine Thompson may have had her struggles over the years with injury and with mental fatigue. But one thing that is noted for sure that she is a fighter. She is a super athlete and she can run very fast when she is in tip top shape. In my opinion, I am looking for something super from her this season. I'm looking for some exciting, blistering times. Keep watching Sports Circle 345 for your latest news, views, and reviews. Keep that diet block and remember to subscribe to the channel before you leave. Peace out.